Have you ever thought, after reading a positive daily inspiration or a positive daily affirmation, have you ever thought that this is just what I was thinking? And sometimes you might question, why can't I put my ideas into words like this? Well, I say to you, of course you can. And when you learn to, it will become one of the most powerful things you've ever done. I'm suggesting that today you try writing down the ideas that come to you as you think about your own special needs, your own special desires. Write your own affirmations. Write your own story the way that you want it to be. If there is a healing need, well, You write out a simple healing statement. You write it down, and then you add it to your thoughts about prayer and healing and faith and God's will. If there is a need for prosperity, well, you write it down, and you find that as you do so, you will have it. Harmony, success, peace, joy, whatever you formulate your own prayer statement. You write down a few words and it will have tremendous power because you wrote it about you. And then you will say it and you'll say those few words and they will express your thoughts about the fulfillment of the need. Find a Bible verse that you like, one that seems to be just for you this day and write it down. Putting your faith into words will call forth a creative spirit inside of you. It will jolt your soul into action. It will give you a feeling of spiritual achievement. It says in James 1 verse 22, be doers of the word. When you're not just reading the word, but you're a doer of the word, it changes things inside of you. You become your prayer. You can do all things through Christ in you. And I am holding that you can do this also. And as you write a statement of faith in positivity about what you want to have in the outcome of some situation, well, you will see, with God's help, it come to pass.